Hi everyone, so I'm here today to do a Let's Make with you. Um, I'm working with uh, Artie Maisie's uh, oddment, oddment kits, uh, one, two and three. They're all modelled up now because I've printed them and cut them up. And also her four butterfly um, stamps. So I will link all the kits below. Like I said, there's three of the ticket ones, the oddment ones. And then there's obviously these um, four butterflies. So I was just basically doing some um, like decoupage tags and I thought I'd come along. I've made these three because they're going into the journal that I've nearly finished. And I'm just going to show you quickly how I'm doing these. So, um, where's my ruler? Right, I've got a stash of stuff here and some of the little bits from the um, all the kits that I've mentioned I've just obviously not pulled them all out but these are the things that I'm going to work with these are just scraps of music paper and bits of Artie Maisie's um, digital kits and whatnot the the cardstock that I'm working on you can use anything if you know playing cards uh, packaging um, these I don't I'd actually cut these I, I know I bounce off of centimeters and inches but this is 15 centimeters by eight and I'll try and work this out because I that ruler I can't do it too many lines on it confuses me this is three and one eighth by uh five and seven eighths i hope that helps um because one of the videos that i done the other day <laughs> i didn't actually say what i was working in and someone messaged me saying if one was that centimeters or inches and um, it was we had a bit of a laugh about it because i just assume everybody knows what i'm talking about um anyway i'm using a glue stick you can use a wet glue or a decoupaging glue um i'm just going to use the glue stick just for convenience here so um i'm gonna do some of it up anyway just to so i've got a little bit to play and obviously you can do any size you like you don't have to do them the size i'm doing them um just whatever size it's quite um it's very warm so the glue's gone all like funky gunky <laughs> if that's even all funky gunky glue um so yeah it's getting a bit soft um, so there we go, you can see there's bits of blobby bits there. So I'm just going to find some papers. I think I'm going to use uh, some of this music paper, which is like vintage music paper. And uh, I'm just going to, oh, what side actually? I might use this side. So I'm just going to put that on there, like that. Um, I do have a card that I normally squish it all down with and then I'm just going to trim that off in fact I'll leave now I will trim it off now because I'm adding other bits I'll need to see where where the end is and what I'm going to do with all of these as well is sew around them and um, back them with some teal coffee dyed papers so that they're not white on the back right that did go on the floor if anybody's wondering my bin's somewhere else at the moment um i've actually got stuff stacked on top of the bin um right then i think i will use some of this uh, i'm gonna put that down there so i'll just glue on the back of that hope everyone's having a great weekend um the weather's starting to pick up again here it got a bit chilly last week but now it's beginning to brighten up and get a bit hotter which is great um more garden time right now i'm going to look for some of i'm going to use some of that but i'm just gonna They're lovely. These little glue sticks I got on Amazon. They're only like the 10 gram ones, but I got 25 for like six pound, which I thought was really good. So and they do, to me, they work really well. I, uh, apart from the fact that when it's hot, they get a little bit gloopy. <laughs> Funky gunky. <laughs> right. Um, I'm going to use some of this again. That's a bit of Artie Maze's one of our kits, butterflies in blue. Uh, 
some of the background papers. So I'm just gonna do a little bit down there. I'm just gonna glue straight onto that. And then cut that off. And I kind of want something down in the middle here. <clears throat> What do I want? Um, oops. No, I don't want that. Decisions, decisions. I'll use a little bit of this music paper because it's a completely different tone, but in colour. Uh, this is a printable one, whereas that one was original. Uh, yep, I'll put that one there. Can ink all these up if you want, but I, what I'd normally do is when it's all dried on there, I just kind of go over it with my uh, distress ink. Okay, right. Now I'm getting into these tickets. Just gonna cut around these. Should have done that beforehand, but I just thought of doing this when I, d I was doing them. Um, and I am going to ink this up because there's a bit of white on it that I don't want. Let's see, do we want it that side? <clears throat> nope, I'm going to put it on that side. I find this type of crafting so therapeutic. You know, you can just do what you like. There's no, there's no real, you know, there's no right and there's no wrong to this. Just checking the time. The butterfly here is obviously from the um, the butterfly uh, stamp, the four stamp collection. Like I said, I will link them all below so that you can go over and check them all out. Um, so I'm just going to pop that there. You know, this is so quick and easy to make. Um, I'm going to use one of them and a little label these labels come in bigger sizes as well she's andrea sorry to say that you know call her she there um andrea has done these like in her full size and then she's done them like smaller so you can get like there is actually two to a page when you get the kit so that you don't have to shrink it all down which i think is all for and i don't know if i want that one it's a bit bright i think i might use this one Like I said, sorry you're uh, watching me cut this out because if I didn't, if I'd have cut it out, we'd probably be finished by now. Uh, I, would, I want to say as well, thank you so much to everyone who is um, watching, obviously, my let, Let's Make videos and saying, you know, that you're enjoying them and, you know, you like the shorter videos because I'm the same. I do. Don't get me wrong, I, I do watch longer videos um but the quicker videos it's like i want to see i want to do i want to do it <laughs> i just want to get it get it watched and try it i don't want to watch for an hour and then try um whoops that didn't stick at all there we go so i'm just doing that we're going to put this here i might put something else there as well no um no I might actually do that and put that on there as well. There we go. We're nearly done. And what I'll do is I'll go off camera and saw them and show you them all sold. And I'll punch a hole in them and put some string through them. So, right. It's me calling this done, I think, and obviously I will ink it up. Um, I'll just go over it with my sponge. Take some of these whitey bits away. So there we go. Quick and easy. Lemon squeezy. That was my first one, I think. Was it that one? No, that was my first one. Um, 
and then I done that one and that one. I might actually add something else to that. But there we go. So I'm gonna go sew these and then I will I will be back. So there we have it. I've sewed them all around, added some um coffee or tea dyed paper, just punched a hole, put a little hole reinforcer on them and a piece of string. So that's how quick and easy they were to do. Um there was one, oh yeah, this one here, I just thought there was too much um, of the red ticket without anything breaking it up. So I just put one of these on there. Again, that's from one of the ornaments and uh, tickets from Artemis. And it actually had other numbers, but I just wrapped it around. You can't see it because obviously I've covered it over. So that just broke that up a little bit for me. So there we have it. I hope that was um, helpful, useful. If, um, like I said, I will put all the... Um, the links to the well it's four kits actually so it's the butterfly and then the free ticket kits from Artie Maze. I'll put them below so if you want to go over and check them out and if you do have any questions just ask and thanks for watching bye